Hello and good morning from one of my favorite places in Virginia. I'm at my friend's home right now. There's so much nature. <sighs> I think I got the best sleep that I've had since being back in the United States. We go back to Costa Rica on Saturday. It's Monday now, so I'm really excited. And yeah, I definitely got the best sleep considering I'm out in nature. I fell asleep with the windows open. Nice, cool morning. Ooh, incredible. But yeah, so my plan coming back to the United States, I was like, all right, I'm going to come back here. I'm going to hit it hard with my business. I'm going to stay inspired. I'm going to get all this stuff done. And of course, when I came back, I got sick, <laughs> which basically almost always happens. Maybe it's my body telling me to slow the heck down, but whatever this was, <clears throat> ooh, it was gnarly. I tried doing a video like a few weeks ago and I was just like coughing and sneezing through the whole thing, so I just decided not to post that one. And I was like, my, my mind just was not clear and was not with it. Um, so yeah, plus when I come back, I stay in Northern Virginia at my parents' house and wow, it is just so hectic there and so busy and it's always interesting coming back to the United States to kind of like reflect and I kind of get dragged back into that life and I know that it's not about like where I am it's just like another test to our mind to how we can be no matter where we are so coming back to the United States is always a challenge for me I don't feel like I'm always in as much nature as I want I don't have as much time as I usually do for myself as like a parent juggling my work my kid family stuff so I did take a little trip down to where I used to live which is down by Harrisonburg Virginia which I just love I lived here for five years before I moved to Costa Rica absolutely love this area it's full of nature and mountains good people nice community so it's been really refreshing I've been here since last Wednesday it's Monday now I'm about to leave Woo. I feel refreshed <laughs> to get through the last few days here in the United States. But yeah, so sometimes things just don't always go as to, as we plan. You know, my this trip going into it, I definitely had a different vision and a different plan for it. And I definitely spent probably like 75% of it pretty sick. Not getting up early because my body just like couldn't. Um... And you know what? That's okay. Did the best I could. Got my rest. Saw some friends. And when I get back to Costa Rica, I'll be back to normal and back to what I'm usually up to, which is awesome. But yeah, sometimes things just don't go to plan, and that's okay. <laughs> but it definitely does. You know, I would like, I'll be working with people who are probably in the United States mostly or in Canada. And it's, it's good for me to come back and get an understanding again of what people are dealing with and maybe why it's so hard for us to stay connected to ourselves. Even I find that here, I feel more disconnected from myself. I mean, when, when you know, I, I get why it is the way it is. It's like, it's hard to stay connected with your own thoughts, connected with your own emotions, with what's going on inside of yourself, to even like process your day to day experiences when. It's so busy. It's busy. There's so much stimulation. There's so much. There's so many distractions. Um, there's just so many things to take care of and to do. You know, the life maybe isn't as simple unless you really try to design your life and make it more simple. <laughs> but I definitely get how it is. But I don't look at it again as a place that can determine your mental state. Um, that's just, you know, we can't control all the things that are outside of us. The only thing we have control of is ourselves, our own vibration, and, you know, our own attraction point. So it's it's good to go to new places even if you're out. I guess I find it easiest to um, flow in that aspect when I'm in a new place. So that's why this trip's been really awesome. It's been very flowy. It's been very great. I've gotten to see all the people I wanted to see. It all just like clicked in perfectly. It was really fantastic. Um, so yeah, it's all right. If you're, sometimes things aren't going as planned. You get back up the next morning or you give yourself some of that space and some of that time and you get back to it. 
that's all you can do. So I'm looking forward to getting back to it. I'm already getting back into it. Being here has been very inspiring. Again, I think I'm just inspired by nature and peace. That's my personal inspiration. I guess you just got to find out what's inspiring to you and make sure that you're making room for that in your life. And yeah, see how things are going to shoot off and grow and see what new ideas come to you and um, yeah, try to manage that vibration so all that new fun stuff can come on into your life. So yeah, just popping in again since I haven't posted in a while. <clears throat> Not really on purpose. I honestly wasn't feeling too inspired. I wasn't feeling really good myself. But we're going to be back at it. That's all we can do. And yeah, I will be posting more updates as we get back, as more inspiration flows, as things start moving along. I'm working on designing um, some programs for other single moms who are looking for flexibility in their lives and their schedules, getting to be more with their kids, kind of getting to be outside of a system that's just not working for them. Like, this system just doesn't work for me. <laughs> Being in an office or whatever job, 40 plus hours a week, not getting to see my kid, like things like that, that just doesn't work for me. And I don't think that works for some other people either. So if you're one of those people that that just doesn't work for, you let me know and I will see how I can be of a help. Because yeah, it's going to be little by little, but things are things are moving on this end and I'm really excited to share it as it comes up and yeah, as it happens. So that is all. I'm going to enjoy the rest of the scenery before I head back to Northern Virginia, the craziness, preparing to leave. I'm going to try and stay inspired, keep my mind set up and... That's all we can do, just those every little day things. All right. Oof. <laughs> See ya.